हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स ये वन स्टॉप फॉर लर्निंग ऑल द मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स विच विल मेक यू स्मार्टर एंड कैलकुलेट टेन टाइम्स फास्टर इन योर माइंड यस मेंटल मैथमेटिक्स इज वंडरफुल इफ यू नो द बेसिक्स ऑफ दीज स्मॉल थिंग्स यू नो विच मेक यू स्मार्टर ऑब्वियसली द कैलकुलेशन एट हायर लेवल आर गोइंग टू बिकम इवन मोर इजियर सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेक अप द एड एंड सब्ट्रैक्ट एन एक्स फास्टर part and in this video i am going to specially focus on mental addition using place values so you will see how quickly we can add the numbers if you have those basic competencies so let's look at the concept used in this trick mind you all the things which i will do on the board here they are for demonstration purpose and all those things actually have to be done in the mind when you look at the numbers you uh, have to you know follow those steps which i tell you on the board here in your mind and then get to the answer of the sum of two numbers three numbers four numbers directly in the mind so what does place value mean and how this place value trick works in mental maths let's have a small glimpse of the concept used in the trick now suppose i have 73 the number 73 now when i say the number 73 i say 70 and 3 now this is what i mean uh, uh, by saying that i have to break the number according to its place value like 7 is in the tens place so 7 tens are 70 so that is why i have wrote 70 here and this is 3 ones 3 into 1 3 so when i say 73 in the mind it is actually 73 likewise when i say uh, 267 so look at the way i am calling the number 267 so if you add them you are going to get the same number 267 now when i say 267 it's a big number but when i say 267 all three parts are separated according to the place value of the digits in 267 the number three digit number right 200 is easy to understand easy to add likewise 60 because it contains a zero in the units place it is easy to add and likewise seven is a single digit number which is even more easier to add now students will face a difficulty when they have to add 84 and 97 mentally but can they do 84 97 like this in the mind now again i i must tell you again and again that these are mental math steps so if i am writing them here this is for your understanding sake now 8 and 9 is 17 so we have 17 tens and 7 plus 4 obviously is 11 and therefore adding 170 and 11 is far more easier than adding 84 and 97 now this is the trick which we are going to use for mental addition of numbers let us now take up some examples the first example which i am going to take up is 26 plus 69 so again when i uh, you know uh, say these numbers 26 it is not 26 it is 26 so 20 and 6 and then 69 is 60 and 9 now immediately when you say or read these two numbers you should know 20 and 60 is 80 and 6 and 9 is 15 now there is an extra 10 here so this carries forward so 80 becomes Uh, exactly, you know when when you carry forward one, this is a one extra ten here. So there there are eight tens here. Now they become nine tens and a five, which makes it ninety five. Likewise, if you have three numbers, again the same thing works: seventy and three, eighty and four, thirty and eight. Now adding these round figures far more easier, right? Eight plus seven, fifteen plus three. 18 so 18 tens and here we have how much 
8 plus 4, 12 plus 3, 15. So here you have 18 tenths and one more tenth comes from here makes it 19. So 19 tenths and a 5 makes it 195. Again, all these are mental st math steps and see how beautifully these steps work when you have three digit numbers. Here you have 528 and then you have 262. Now these are hundreds, so seven hundreds and then you have the 80 and then you have the 10. Now 8 tenths and 1 ten makes it 9 tenths. So 700 and 9 tenths means 90 is your answer for the question. Likewise, if I have to do it here without actually having to write or remember all these steps in the mind, I can still do it. Let's start from the hundreds. Here you have 300, here you have 700. So in all you have 10 hundred. 10 hundred means 1000. And now let's think about the tens. Here you have three tens, here you have zero tens and here you have six tens. So in all you have nine tens which is 90. And finally the unit digit 9 plus 615 plus 419. See how beautifully we can get to the answer of this addition problem. Now 1000 90, 19. 90 and 19 is like 9 tenths here. So, 1 more 10 makes it 10 tenths that is 100 and 9. So, 1109 becomes the sum of the number. See here I wrote all the steps. That is why it was looking like difficult. But you, when you start practicing by taking 30, 40, 50 questions at a stretch, you will be uh, you realize that this is really working and the time you are taking to add these numbers is getting reduced slowly. So let's have one more so that we can understand this. Here we have four digits, three digits, two digits. So the thousands are seven thousand only. The hundreds are two hundreds and three hundreds. So five hundreds. The tens are eight tens, nine tens. 9 plus 5, 14 tenths, which is 140. And finally, 3 plus 2, 5 plus 6, 11. Now, 7000 is pretty obvious here. 7000, 500 and one more 100 makes it 600. And then we have the 40 here and 11 here, which makes it 51. And now you can pick up the calculators and check your answer. 7651. Is that the sum of these numbers? And you will also do it orally when you use this place value trick in all your addition problems. So start working on these skills. This forms the base of so many higher calculations. You know, people who can add mentally, they can subtract mentally, they can multiply the numbers mentally, they can even divide the numbers mentally. And when it comes to decimals, fractions, you know, all those things become so easy if you are good in mental addition. So friends, if you like this video, do share it with all your friends. Do not forget to subscribe the channel, the channel and click the bell shaped icon for getting the notifications on your mobile. Uh, do look for the next part of this video where I am going to tell you one more amazing trick of mental edition. Till then, all the best for your practice.